Hey guys, welcome back to the course. So in this lecture, we're gonna quickly go over some of my favorite reasons why you should start a mobile app development business. So I've listed out seven reasons, but there's plenty other ones. Um, these are my seven favorites because I think that in my experience, these are the ones that um, were by far the most important. Hopefully for some of you out there who are on the fence about starting a mobile app business, hopefully this can help you get over that hump and actually start. Now, the first reason is actually pretty obvious. Um, it's that everybody out there needs or wants a mobile application. Now, obviously, what do I mean by that? Well, mobile applications are not new, but they are still relatively new. We finally got to the point with mobile applications that almost every company has some type of mobile strategy. And if they haven't already built their mobile application, they're actively looking for a way to build it. Now, it just doesn't make sense for the vast majority of businesses out there to hire their own team, their own designer, their own developer, to put together an in-house mobile application. So what that means for us is that these companies are not gonna build it in-house, so they're looking outwardly. They're gonna be looking for freelancers and companies that specialize in making mobile apps. And the biggest reason why I love this is that it's because it's the easiest sell in the world. Everybody wants one or at least knows that they should get one eventually. So when you talk to a company and you say, this is what I do and this is why I'm good at it, it's one of the easiest sells out there. It's much easier to sell a mobile application than it is to sell a web application or it is to sell a desktop software. Now you might think that that means there's a lot of competition out there, but it's actually not the case. There are not a lot of studios and businesses out there that are dedicated solely to mobile applications. Now, I'm making this statement relative to web applications. So there's plenty of money out there. If you have prior established contacts, you know anybody who's at a big business, they probably need a mobile application. And so you're really just one or two points away from making a sale. Number two, it's actually very rewarding work. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, there's a lot of different ways that you can be involved in tech and most of the businesses out there will only deal with one section of a product. In that case, what ends up happening is someone comes to you and says, I need this specific work done, you do it, and that's it. There's no context, you don't understand the greater picture of why you do it, and you never get to see what the end product is. A lot of times you're gonna be building something or creating something and you never actually see it function. Now, this is not the case with a mobile app development business. When you come to someone and you are in charge of building their mobile app, you get to see it from napkin, from conception, from that first spark in their head, all the way to the end when you see it out there being used, um, getting feedback and actually gathering real users. So the ability to see ideas go all the way from the beginning to the end, that's extremely rewarding. At the end of this, you'll have a portfolio of mobile applications that you probably were involved at every step of the process. You'll know them intimately and you'll be able to demonstrate that you can build something that actually has real world success. It's also a lot of fun to be working in mobile. Mobile is an entirely different paradigm. People use it differently, people interact with it differently, and there's tons of possibilities in mobile that are not possible in web. 